Alright you guys, I got this LG Flatron W2252TQ from a buddy. He just gave it to me for free, it won't turn on or anything. It was manufactured in 2008, there's the model number, W2252TQT. And upon taking it apart, it took a while, you have to take off the front bezel and all this crap, the metal shield. But uh, it just hangs there. But anyways, let's go zoom in front. And we got some bad capacitors. You see that? So bad capacitor here, here, and here. Three bad capacitors. And when capacitors go bad, usually the voltage regulator goes bad too. So I'm going to have to check that out. Replace these. These are 15 volt, 1000 microfarad. And this one here, hard to see. Let's see. There we go, I think. 3.5, I see something. Can't really make that out. Anyhow, I'll have to take that out, take a look at it. And this one right here. They're uh, Chinese capacitors and usually those go bad. That one there, that 40, 470 microfarad 35 volts is good. It's just these three right here if you could see them. Can't really get the value off that one there. Okay. If it's there, that means, yeah, the value is, the value is in there somewhere. I don't know if you can see it. It's again, it's a 470 microfarad, 35 volts. And that one there is, uh, like I said before, 16 volts, 1000 microfarad. So yeah, and there's probably another thousand microfarad. So yeah, that's the problem there. And also I have to check the voltage regulator, take that out and see what's going on with that. But after replacing these and putting the monitor back together, hopefully we should be getting this going again, you guys. And I'll just give it back to Buddy because I don't need another monitor. Just fix it for him and say, here you go. Because he was going to actually throw this away. But anyways, yeah, LG Flatron, you guys. So, give you a little update on this later on. See if I could get it going. Alrighty. Have a good one, you guys.